Hi, in this video, we are going to see with user mode in Apex security. What is with user mode? What is the advantage we have with with user mode? So in the previous video, we applied field level security with the help of with security enforced. With security enforced has some limitation. We saw that limitation, right? We were not able to apply field level security when the field was in the wire condition. It means that with security enforced in SOQL will not check fields other than in the select and from class. It means that with security enforced will check only the field level security. It will apply the field level security for the fields which is available in the select as well as from class. If the field is you know, used in the wire condition or it is used in the order by class, then with security enforced will not be helpful. In that scenarios, with user mode will be helpful for that. With user mode has the capability of addressing the field level security wherever the field might be. The field might be in the select class, the field might be in the from class, field might be in the order by class, all the classes, the with user mode will check that. Let's quickly switch to the arc and see what the issue we faced in the previous implementation. So previously the implementation what we had is the user GARC doesn't have access for total salary field. We expected that since we have introduced with security enforced, this will throw an exception and the exception will be catched and empty list will be passed to the GARG, right? But still, even though with security enforce is applied, GARG able to see the information from the object, right? He's able to see the total records. He's able to see the department name because with security enforce is not working for the wire class. So the solution is, let's try to change the with security enforced. Let me replace with security enforced with user mode keyword, okay? User mode. Now, let me save this piece of code. Now, let me save this piece of code. It is saving. So we are expecting that with the user mode now should block the user. Okay, perfect. Now we are expecting that with user mode will throw an exception. If any exception thrown in the try block, it will be catched and it will be sending an empty list back to GARG window. Right? This is the expectation. Let's see whether we were able to overcome the drawback of with security enforced with the help of user mode. Let me switch quickly switch to you know GARG window. This is GARG window. Now GARG trying to refresh the department list uh, VF page. Now, beautiful, see, Gork not able to see any of the information and total records available for him also zero. It means that he has object level access. He has a record level access. He has two records. He's owning two records, but still he is getting zero records because the reason is he doesn't have field level access for total salary. Since total salary is referred in the wire class with user mode has the capability of, you know, throwing exception. This is what, you know, the business expects. If the user doesn't have access for this field, then nothing should be displayed, right? We were able to achieve this with the help of with user mode. So with user mode will work for wire class. It will work for the select class from class and will give you one more information. If you are going to apply record level access, for example, let me try to change this piece of code. Suppose if you are going to apply without sharing here, without sharing, what is meant by without sharing? If it is without sharing means still all the records, right? Should be available for the logged in user. But what user mode will do, it will change it internally to with sharing. Okay, so basically with user mode will override without sharing into with sharing. So it is covering record level security. It is covering the select class security. It is covering the from class. It is covering the wire class. So 
user mode has more advantage than with security and force. So in real time, whenever you are working with, uh, you know, security of fields or object, you can, you know, confidently go ahead with user mode. If you are interested to learn Salesforce, visit AJ Skill Development website. There you can find our course curriculum and you can come to know about the list of courses we are offering. We are offering Salesforce Administrator and Salesforce Development courses. To know about us and the team, you can visit our About Us section. This is an organization we are doing at Salesforce training from 2018, and we have trained out and guided 2,000 plus candidates so far. And if you also want to know about our placement assistance, visit our placement assistance section where you can find the list of people and the category. You can see the list of people who got uh, trained and placed from our site. You can also visit their LinkedIn pages to get to know about our training and also the feedback from the relevant trainees, okay? And also, if you want to do the course inquiry, click on contact us, you will see the form. You can fill the form and submit the inquiry. Our team will get back to us. Thank you.